Hi, my name is Katie Zeskins. I am the owner and clinical director at Wisdom Within Counseling in Nyanta, Connecticut. I wanted to go over a great approach to working with a, a child, adolescent, or teenager. And this is all about using self-compassion to allow what's called your true self to lead. So sometimes kids will have what are called parts pop up. So a fear-based part, um, an anxious part, a worried part, um, an angry part. Um, we all have parts of us that develop. And hi Paula, how are you? Um, and this helps your child or your teenager to compartmentalize. So to say, instead of saying, I am hungry, or I am angry, or I am about to self-harm, a part of me is angry, but my true self is feeling calm. So there is this um, ability to separate thoughts, feelings, and behaviors. And so when a person becomes hurt or traumatized, um, they really develop what are called exiles. So exiles are parts of us that feel shame, that feel like we don't belong in the world, um, that are stuffed away. And these parts are desperate for attention. So they will torment our system. We kind of stuff them away, we push them aside with what are called firefighters. These parts of us are the numbing parts. So it could be a sex addiction, it could be trying drugs and alcohol, it could be a phone addiction, video gaming. Um, these are the numbing parts. Um, and so when an exile is kind of coming out and we don't know what to do, a teenager will often self-harm or um, kind of do a damaging behavior, like try to go out and drink or um, something like that. And these are very extreme feelings. So a firefighter jumps into action to try to numb out the exile. We also have parts of us that are called managers and they try to keep you functional and safe. So these are the parts that help you work, that keep you organized, that mean control maintain control of your environment um, and also tend to be really critical. Our inner critic um, tend to be really controlling, um, high anxiety, and this is also the part of us, the managers, are sabotaging our system because they also focus on taking care of others' needs before our own. So the idea here is to have the true self lead the system and work in therapies to help the exiles, firefighters, and managers step aside and realize that you're safe, that you don't have to and kind of take on these self-sabotaging behaviors. And you know, when you learn that each part of you is a unique inner child, you're actually releasing that part from their intense role and can really help your true self lead and feel confident, uh, calm, and compassionate towards yourself. Thanks so much for watching about Internal Family Systems with Katie Ziskins. Find tons of free info online at wisdomwithinct.com. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.